I use a different, uh, a few different strategies. So there's two different things that I do. First off, I will use, have you ever heard of keyword shitter before? Yeah, yeah, I've heard of it's that like one. The, it's like yeah. the best name ever. I think it's hilarious. Uh, but that website, I love it because that usually gets like the Google auto uh, autocomplete like responses into there. Um, so I'll do, I always use like who, what, when, where, why, how. So how do something related to your niche? Who does something related to your niche? Like I always do who, what, when, where, why, how. And I start with that. And I think in terms of that, and if you just press submit there, you'll get a bunch of ideas. Um, once I have that, I'll then go to uh, Ahrefs. I always use them. Um, and I'll plug them into there to see the competition. I personally, I, I, you know, they, they base their, their competition strictly off of links, like 100%. They've said that. Um, and I don't think that their, their competition metric is all that great. So I'll put it in there, but I'll also put it into Longtail Pro. Um, or maybe it's platinum now. That's like an old school, uh, keyword tool that like, you know, a lot of people use, but like, I know there's a bunch of them out there. Like keyword.io, I think is one of, there's a ton of them out there, but I basically will put them into both. I'll put them in a spreadsheet and I'll put the results of Ahrefs in one and I'll put the results of Longtail Pro in the other. And I do that because I want to see a scope of both of them next to each other. Because I found sometimes like Ahrefs won't even say, it'll say like, oh, it doesn't even have any search volume. Well, yes, it does. It has 80 a month. And I go for that, by the way, if anyone's wondering, I go for that low stuff. I'm okay with 20 to 30 searches a month on one of those tools because usually 20 to 30 searches a month is actually three or four times that because there's different variations of that question. Um, so yeah, so I do that keyword research using those. And then I'll also do... When my website is getting authoritative and it's starting to do well, I'll then look at my my competitors, my poor competitors, and I'll uh, I'll basically look at what they've done. And if they if they're doing something that I don't have at that point, and I know that my website's frankly like more authoritative and better than theirs, I'll look at that. I'll look at that article, see what they wrote, write something way better, and then I usually rank above them. So, but that's like a secondary thing. Like in the beginning, I usually will start with you know keyword shitter and and doing it that way. So.